Hey guys, it's uh, Variety Nerd here, back for uh, episode 10 of my Sun Jian uh, playthrough. Uh, last time we left off sieging the settlement here of Chang Sa Trade Port, uh, so I could finally get it back. And it looks like Huang Zhu has decided to sally out and attack me. I'm guessing they pretty much ran out of military supplies, or are about to. So let's hop right into the battle. If we are bold and strong, victory will be ours. Their corpses will soon litter the battlefield. There is strength in mystery. Do not be arrogant. Let no odds dampen our zeal! Okay, so they're gonna attack me from here. They have reinforcements coming in. I do have some trees here. Uh, there's a nice hill on this side. Uh, so do we want to go on the hill? Or by the trees? Uh, I'll go by the trees actually to make the uh, Try not to get to get some defensive pretty much on the trees. I could do is put all of you in the trees here and maybe put my front line out here mm, You guys go back there Okay, you guys can we... Oh, we can't put you in the... Crap, okay. So then I guess I should put you guys in front as you get the better uh, protection. So I'll do that. So some of you, I will, I'll put one of you in here, kind of defend against uh, any sort of cav. I don't remember if they have cav, so put the cav in there. You guys back here. Don't want the archers wasting or wasting their ammo on my spearmen. Let's go with... Actually, let's put you guys down there. Spears there. A little bit further back. Here we go. right there okay so that should be oh we have one archer here uh, what we could do actually we could leave a couple archers give me some of these archers stick them over here that's good uh, you guys will Put you in the trees as well. Put you guys forward a bit. Okay, let's start the battle. Oh, 
enemy reinforcements are on the field. Oh, over there, okay. Yeah, right. Uh, speed everything up. Let's just have you guys not fire right away. You guys going in the trees? What's going on here? Maybe what we should do is we should move the, these guys out a little bit. Guys, right there. Strategist over there. G militia there. That way, you guys are a little bit further away from them. So they're gonna walk right into the trap. There we go. Get a nice killing ground going here. Okay, so now what should I do? Take on the archer militias or take out the lancers? Um, just speed it up a little bit more. Wait a minute. Our hidden men have been seen! There we go, take out those archers. Okay, uh... We'll just got a few guys auto-fire on whatever we got. Now that I think about it, what I should have done... Is I should have had my spearmen... Should have had more spears over there. Okay, you guys turn yourselves off, don't fire anymore. Take 
take out those uh Cav, you guys get directly in here. Let's go. The men have no ammunition. Draw your weapons. You guys get in the trees. Get rid of those archers. The men have no ammunition. Draw your weapons! And are ready! Now! Do not relent! Archers, prepare! Bowmen! Let missiles fly! Shoot! Make ready! Take heed, warriors! Move out quickly! Onward! Take heed! Can you guys go up here? We'll take out these archers. Just stand right here because you're getting shot to bits. Um, try to deflect some of those Locked arrows. Stand ready! Stand ready! Warrels, attend! Just get all the crossbows in there. Not the best to use for them, but. Crossbow straight into combat. Just get everybody in here. Unit flees. What cowards! Do not relent. Over the here for the bonuses. The enemy unit flees. Just don't get into what combat. Cowards. Steal yourselves. Destroy them. Unleash fury. Make ready. Stand by for orders. Strike. Show no mercy. At the ready. Zoo. That would be nice to finally do that. Get rid of him. These guys are pretty close to their deathbed. We'll let you guys rest for a bit here. Okay, run away a bit. Actually, just charge right into them. Let's see how much damage we do. Okay, get back out. Move out quickly. There we go. 
take heed, warriors. You take out the archer captain over there. Archers ready. Ready. The enemy warriors are running. Ha! Excellent. There we go. Nice. Play victory. Oh, it was a close victory. All right. Much better than a valiant defeat. Much better. From the roots to heaven. Twenty nine heroism, nice. Oh, Sillery's gained. It's good. Uh we'll take the replenishment. Tao Ying signed a peace treaty, Huang Shao. Uh, we completed the strong economy because we built the school. Let's get 10 satisfaction for Guang Jia for 10 turns. And 20 income from commerce and 5 satisfaction for strategist faction wide for 5 turns. Nice. Brothers in arms, been a long time since you've seen your sworn kin. China is vast and the country's needs are many. You've been separated in the name of progress for so long. Upon being reunited, there is little anyone can do to stop you embracing overjoyed at finally seeing one another again. Satisfaction plus 10 Lu Fan. So Ju Sun Juan and uh, Sun Jian and Lu Fan have deepened their relationship. Well, that's good. Okay, uh, where did I build that school? Probably get rid of it now. Get rid of the school. Built it in uh, here, didn't I? Yeah. Uh, yeah. We'll demolish the school for now. We don't need it. Cheng Pu has a point. Uh, what do we want to put this in? Immune to terror would be nice. The gaze to charge the attack would also be nice for Spearman. Charge bonus. Uh, yeah, let's take uh, bravery. So we'll negate the charge bonus and get immune to terror and fear. Or, yeah. Uh, Sun Jian. Remain poised. Gonna take keep taking you to Ba. Oh, oops! I hit the wrong spot. My bad. I attacked the army. Whoops! <laughs> Not happening this turn. Uh, okay, so we got a farmer plus four resolve plus twenty percent food production for the administered commandery. And a craftsman, plus two experience, plus five percent income from industry in the administered commander. Clearness demands renewal. Oh, go and attack Ba. Uh, so Quan Quian and Yun uh, Zichun have become friends. Sun Jian and Quan Quian relationship lost for reasons. The problem with gaining relationships and losing relationships is not always clear exactly when they get lost. It's just kind of like they get lost. Why? I don't know. Um. I guess I could check the court. Maybe it will tell me why. Uh. We fought side by side. So, bonus. We're still technically O sworn. Okay, so we are uh, oh sworn we get a bonus for battle, but we also get a negative for battle. We fought side by side, we won but lost many soldiers. But I, you, we did fight together. We never fought together. What? Okay, I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. Um, buildings are complete. 
Uh, Jilong's trespassing. Absolutely not. Oh, that's fine. Let's see what to upgrade. What to upgrade now? Get some more food. Uh, maybe. Hmm. And you must upgrade the small. Oh, your settlement to a region seven. Oh, it has to be go up to seven for it. What about private? No, it was not private. It was uh, state. Oh, so I should just build state workshops then. Sounds like a better bloody idea. So this is currency inspector office. Coin maker. What's the coin maker? Oh, this guy here. Uh, we don't have the thing for it. Oh, I see. Okay, so we're going to have to level up our settlements here, then. Let's level you up, I guess, to seven. Is it seven all the way up? Seven, 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 seven. Acquires jade as a resource as well, and artisans. Wow. Uh, okay. So, jade comes from a jade mine, but artisans, where do they come from? Fishing. Or, here's artisans. Proficient artisans will be provided by certain buildings in commandery capitals. Oh, that's, uh, that's, that's real helpful. <laughs> <laughs> it comes from certain buildings. I, I gathered that. I just don't know which ones. Um, market wharf. Description. No, it doesn't come from military buildings. Uh, Confucian temples. Uh, state workshops. Unlocks the resource uh, industrialist. So, unlocks the resource. Ah, so the labor camps. Eventually unlock artisans. Oh, so do um, private workshops. But we need regional seven as well. So anybody else unlock? No, I think it's just those. Eh? Okay. Okay, so we're gonna need another thing to up here. This, these ones require seven. What is this? Copper as well. Okay, so we should go after. We'll go after the labor one, which basically just increases production growth. We can go after private workshop, which technically is the better one. Private workshops. I think I have private workshops somewhere. Nope, that's not private workshop. That is... Ah, uh, here's the private workshop, right? State workshops. No, that's state workshop. Private workshop is this one. Okay, we don't actually need a labor thing here. So let's put the private workshop in this Lingling. Ling. There's Lingling Ling down here. It's mostly farming and there's a bunch of farming peasantry, but We'll use Ling Ling as uh, some of the industry stuff. Or actually, what is my best? Is this my best industry? Ling Ling is 500. 420 at Badong. I mean, 
Um, yeah, I can't really put it here because I have the magistrate and the fishing here. Okay, so Ling Ling will upgrade to the next rank up. Fuling. Fuling is over here. Now we'll save our money. And for you, we'll just uh, auto resolve and take the trade ports back our faith was rewarded yeah we finally get it back we will bring righteousness to this settlement Sunjian plus dynasty so we finally got this uh, mission done so we get plus 4,000 pop growth plus five public order plus 20% income from peasantry faction wide for five turns Wang Zi's gone, or Zhu's gone. So challenge issued. A growing power unifies the South. If we are to secure the Southlands for the uh, for the Sun, uh, there are warriors. Uh, then any warrior standing in our way must be destroyed. Warriors like the Liu family, whose fate is already sealed. Liu Yao, where's Liu? Oh, right. We have to secure the Southlands by destroying Liu Yao in the north. Okay. Sure. So we've got Changsa is finally secured. Uh, we've lost uh, Sun Jian and Cheng Pu. Uh, we've lost faction relationship. Okay. Uh, Cheng Pu and Huang Zhu rivalries lost. Uh, Zuan Zhuchun Huang Zhu relationship lost. Huang Zhu, another one. Uh, Quan Qian and Liu Biao friendship is lost. Didn't know they had a friendship, but good to know. Okay. Remain pure. This is my lovely, lovely trade port, which I am now taking back, and gives me a heck of a lot of commerce income. So that's good. Does anybody want to trade? Anybody want to trade with my massive sprawling empire? Not really. Everybody's still pissed off at me. Nobody seems to like me much. Mmm. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really need it. Need to make peace with anybody. Mm hmm. So Fu Ling, we can build. What do we got here? We got peasantry income. We have a rice paddy. Uh oh, Jesus! Rice paddies give what? Just farming. Okay. Farming, in just food production, but nothing else. Food production, prestige. So we can go with commerce income. State workshops. Go for an inn. What's at the end of the inn chain? Oh, we can go all the way and get uh, tea as well from it. Hmm. But uh, I think we'll just build. Yeah, we'll just build an inn. Doesn't quite matter. And let's end the turn for now. 
So we get a nice plethora of bonuses. Well, that was inevitable. Tao Tao has declared war on us. And we'll call Yuan Shu, but he's not going to come because he's an arse. He's a really shitty ally, to be honest. <laughs> he's a really shitty ally. Uh, Liu Bei declared war on He Yi. Huan Xiao liberated He Yi. Tao Tao declared war on me. Uh, Dong Min signed a peace treaty with Gong Du. Some buildings have been completed and demolitions. Oh, right, yes. Stuff has been demolished. Sun Jian is now philanthropic. Uh, plus two resolve, plus six authority, and plus two public order faction wide. Okay, uh, you, Sun Jian, are actually. Should we go after that army or just go after the city? Let's go after the city. Let's just delegate it. Injustice will be overcome. Money! Oh. 47 gold, not much. I Occupy. To rule with honor. The Bar Commandery is now complete. I answer, my lord. Um, now let's do that for the extra garrisons. Hmm, what else to upgrade here? How much food do we need for that 10? So we're going to need to keep upgrading our food. Uh, do we get food anywhere else here? No, commerce, commerce. What is this? Marketplace. Increases our percentage of commerce income, which would be very nice as we sort by income. I think Changsha gives us the most in terms of commerce. Yeah, so let's just build a marketplace to enhance that and to enhance a bit of our trade. <laughs> So in Runan, what should we build here? That's industry. So we could build a labor chain or we could build down the state workshop. Which will give us artisans. We're doing down the labor chain, which gives artisans or industrialists. We want pop increase and industry, or we could go down. Oh, we already have um, we have state workshops, so private. Oh, that already gives us industrialists. Doesn't it? Yeah. This would give us commerce and industry, but we have no commerce here. So we'll just go straight down labor then. Oh, we have two assignments. I keep forgetting about these. Where's the commerce? Commerce is in Changsha, so let's go to Changsha. Who else we got here? We got uh, Sun Quan for peasantry income. That's good. 
That's 294 peasantry. We have a we have Badong, which is 420. Ooh. Jingling is uh Oh, we can't put him in there. Okay, so then Badong would be the next target, right? What do we got here? 420. Ling Ling is 460. Okay, let's put him in Ling Ling then. And that's the assignments done. We'll just wait another turn. Then we'll invoke the council. Oh, you're going to try to come take that farm from me. So faction succession, Yuan Xiao has been succeeded by Yuan Tan. Dong Min invited Liu Biao into their coalition. Liu Biao requested Dong Min join their war against Yuan Shu. Uh, Regency Mai Tang. Uh, succeeding Mai Tang is the Regent uh, Qian Jinyu. Qian Jinyu requested Liu Biao join their war against Gong Gong Du. So friends stick together. Uh, Sun Jian and Sai uh, Sai Zun's relationship has deepened. Nice. Uh, so I guess Liu Biao is in a coalition now, eh? Where are they? Oh yeah, they're in the biggest coalition. Though so everybody's power is literally weaker than mine, except for Cao Cao's and Yuan Shu's. Oh, and Yuan Tan. Where is Yuan Tan? Well, that's right, he took over Cao's, uh, Yuan Shao's territory. Yes, yeah, still seven turns on that trade. Um. Wang Shao. Well met, friend. Maybe we make some offer some food. Two point five to three point two is point seven. Point seven. Point seven again. Another 0.7 increase. 0.7 increase. Uh, how far can we go here? Okay. Mm. Yeah, we'll trade you. Well, no, we're going to need the food, actually. So, hold on. Nah, we need the food. <laughs> we're actually needing it now. Because um, we're going to be upgrading things soon. Han Empire, small city of Jiang. I'm gonna send you right there and go to ambush dance. Hopefully he comes running back. Like the good little boy he is. I'm gonna send you now. Straight cross here to the livestock farm. Okay, so we can do lots of upgrades.
Okay, where's the places I want to upgrade? Ling Ling is still upgrading. Um, definitely gonna need some more food here, so let's go with. Um, Increase the commerce income. Where's that livestock farm? Yeah, we'll upgrade it. Actually, does that give us more prestige? It does. So let's do that. Fuling. No. I thought it said we could upgrade something. Uh, let's check the public order. Uh, so public order is rising everywhere except for Ba. That's probably just because we took it. Let's get a reform. So, we need to go get, um, well, we could either go down here and get, uh, these, which also give us prestige. Um, so I think we'll do that. Because these, while they give us more money, they won't give us prestige. So we'll keep going down here for now. Maybe we should have taken that first. Oh wait, no, we can't upgrade them because we need to have like rank seven cities. So we can't do that quite yet. We're gonna take the livestock farm. Oh, we're gonna siege it. Okay. Well, that works for me. And we no longer can trade because they're sieging our livestock farm. Yi formed a coalition with Gongdu. Liu Biao requested uh, Quan Jinyu to uh, join their war against me. Okay, so more people to fight. It's always good. He Yi is trespassing. Uh, I don't like that. The enemy has begun siege. Yep. Instructions are completed. We have now got a mathematician. Plus four cunning, plus four reserves faction wide. And some people have been recalled. Okay. Do not break. Let's check the walk. How far can we walk with this? No. I could force march, but then my units will be tired, so I'd rather not. Let's just walk, that should be good enough. Oh, where's he going? I mean, he's got really... Technically, if I think about it, I don't know... He can't actually take anything now that I... He's got, he's got nothing. So I don't really need to, unless actually he's trying to, you know what he's trying to do? He's trying to go all the way up here to uh, Chang Yong. So let's just force march. I mean, even if he attacks me, he's going to be useless. Even with tired units, it wouldn't do much to me. I'm not at war with anybody south, right? No, so this whole area is fine. It's this area that's kind of mostly the hot zone. Uh, Yuan Shu is just getting freaking smacked around from every side. Uh, 
bah, wait, what was the, um... Ah, it was Ling Ling. Still upgrading. Jang Ling. Why does it say two notifications here? Endure the scaling of a mountain to reach awesome views. Okay, let's just upgrade your town. Notification, what does this mean? Oh, just settlement besieged, okay. That's all that means. Oh, apparently we had something to do with our court. Let us talk trade. Gongdu offers us a trade agreement. Oh. They will give me 1,667. Sure, I mean, it is I'll take another trade agreement. I like literally the only other dude offering me one, so yeah, I'll take it. Oh, there's an enemy force. Leo Dai signed a peace treaty with Yuan Shu. Trouble brewing. The least that you can do for your men is to ensure they can work and fight well together. There are those, however, that simply cannot abide one another's presence. Two such warriors are such embittered that they cannot stand to look at each other. This may become a problem if left unchecked. Zhu Yu and Lady Wu have relations deteriorated greatly. Ooh. I don't know. Still says they like each other. Um. Lady Wu. I mean, it still says they're friends. So I'm not really sure what that's about. But we have another administrator slot. So who should we give it to here? Hmm. We give it to uh, Zin Yin Li. And where do we want to put you? you maybe in I'll put you in Badong actually Sunjian and Zhu Yu are now friends. That's good. Okay, uh, let's level up some more cities. I think that will be important. We'll need that for the prestige as well. That will take two turns. That will take five. Let's put a labor camp. Upgrade the labor camp there. Upgrade that to five. That will go up to four building slots. Jiang Jia. Um. Spadong is all the way over there. This is all going to cost me six food upgrade. 
Because these places are upgrading to small, which is negative 2. So that's going to be negative 4. That's going to take it down to 6. I'm going to need some food here. You run through food in this game really fast. And we'll upgrade you as well. Get quite a bit more food and start upgrading settlements again. Lusu. Lusu's in my court. Uh, what does he do? Oh, he's just sitting there in the court, just chilling. Um. Hmm. Gonna give you intuition so that I can go get some of those other, uh, eventually get things like abundance and wisdom at the bottom. Okay, let's move One these guys. So you're pretty weak. You, on the other hand, are a Dong Min army. Where the hell did you come from? Where is Dong Min, by the way? Why must we speak? Oh, he's up there. Right. Right, right, right. Okay. So. Draw in one. No. Let's not move too fast here. Of paths. Ever forward. Let's just keep going that way. Uh, we can't recruit anything. Serve the people. Quan Quien. We're gonna move you. Uh, we can't repair that. Remain supple. So the question is: Marching. Say we move there. You would probably come. Which way would you go? I don't know. If I were to go here, seventy percent chance. Right there. And you would cover essentially both. Not possible. Honor your ideals. I cannot. For China. At ease. Moving out. So that should cover essentially both ways. So now we'll ambush. Hopefully that will work. Oh, we can invoke the council, so let's do that. Strong economy. Uh, want schools. Overpopulation. Upgrade settlement administration. And another overpopulation. Two overpopulations. Get support from artisans and support from peasantry, and a strong economy will give us support from the merchants. Okay, so that's good. So it's good to actually have a variety of guys in the council, variety of general types. Oh, right, we're at war with Tao Tai. I completely forgot about that. Oh, we are actually starting to get a little bit too many wars going on. Ah, oh, no. Uh, do we have walls? We don't. Uh, oh right, this is a evil stuff.
Mishu has been killed in battle. Lost settlement. The Udai invited Zhang Yan into their coalition. Tao Ying requested Han Fu join their war. Han Fu declared war on Dong Ming. Dong Min. So overpopulation is done. So we get both support from peasantry and artists, artisans, which is industry bonus. So now we just have to wait. We have to go up, build a school. The other one. The Yu Biao is contesting Jiang Ling. So let's go and take it back. Return to standard position. Let's just start it out for a second here. We have completed a uh, building in Lingling. Okay. This is our industry place. So we're going to build a. What was it? Private workshop? Yeah, I'll build a private workshop here. Route, trade route's been suspended. And now we got a stone pig. Plus six instinct and plus six satisfaction. Nice. Let's move Sun Jian. Uh, can we go somewhere where you might fall into our trap? I could go there, it's 80% chance there, but only there's gonna be 23% left. Could go here. With purpose. Not possible. Because he might then decide to take Ba Farm and then I can go straight in on the attack. Just ambush you in the tree here. Cheng Sa. We can upgrade the merchant registry office. We shall do that. Didn't you have a free administer slot? Oh, get. Um. Hmm. We'll give it to Sai Sazun here. No, we'll give it to Yun Sichun, no and you will administer. Lingling. Lingling is losing, uh, taking negatives now from population. So yeah. Can we adopt you? We don't have money. Okay. Alright. Uh, okay, so let's. Okay, let's just end. No. Where are you going? Han wrong? I don't know. Let's just end the turn there. And he did exactly what he thought he would. Excellent. Good, good, good. Good. Oh, wait a minute. Where are you guys coming from? This old Dong Min? Dong Min? Jeepers. That's Dong Min? Min? Holy crap. He's, he's a big boy. So, uh, Dong Pashan requested Han Su join their war. Settlement lost. We lost the farmland. Faction succession Dong Min is succeeded by Dong Pashan. Zhang Yan requested Zhang Yang join their war. 
Again, Gong Sun Zan. Then Yang requested Liu and Tan join the war. Gong Sun Zan. Yang Zan requested Liu Dai join the war against Gong Sun Zan. Holy crap. All the war, big wars are kicking off now. Dong Min, ambush been discovered. Oh, okay, so all those armies are up there. I'm fine with that. At the moment. Um, lots of constructions are complete. And our, we now have an inspector. Plus six expertise, plus six cunning, plus six morale for Malik Cav. Steel for battle. For China. Restore order. Pyrrhic victory, eh? So that one, I think we'll just we'll starve them out as well. Let me just take a quick look at the other one. Oh wow, that one's a decisive victory. I guess they moved? Where did they go? Shoot, they went Justice out to the river, didn't they? That's not so great for me. Only by growth will the word be said. Like the wind, not satisfied with winning the battle, our general overtakes the retreating enemy troops and lays a successful ambush, further reducing the numbers that can stand against us. Against us. So, Yuan Zichun gains 600 bonus experience. Nice. We got Jia Ling back under our control. You and Zichan, we shall give you. Hmm. Judgment. For that extra range damage. Where are you off to? I don't like the fact that you're. Oh no! Oh no, you're within striking distance of my capital. Oh no! Oh! Oh! That's not great. I mean, my capital will just move, but if it gets taken out. I cannot. All right, let me take a look at this again here. This farmland map view. Trebs, they'd have to actually come to me because I have the treb. Maybe. Mm. Thing is, I kind of want this place back. So. We're going to start the next episode with the, uh, the battle for the Bach farmland. Uh, and uh, thanks again, guys, for watching. If you guys, uh, if you guys are liking this episode and the series so far, please like, subscribe, and comment. And I will see you guys next time. See ya.